I'm David. I uh, work with Redwater Dodge. Uh, I'm a finance manager and I work in sales as well. Um, this particular vehicle behind me is a uh, 2016 Ram 3500. It's Cummins turbo diesel. We've obviously done some modifications to this truck uh, to make it what we call rig ready. And we built a lot of these packages uh, to spec. We've, we've been testing uh, trial and error to find out what's the perfect build, what's gonna suit our customers the best, what's gonna last the longest and the best possible product that we can build. And uh, this is basically what we've come up with. A lot of dealerships, they'll, they'll kind of experiment with, with different ways, uh, different kinds of trucks, and, and they kind of cheap out on some of the parts that they use. Uh, we literally spare no expense. We use BDS. It is one of the more expensive brands to use as far as our lifts are concerned. But uh, the way we look at it is, is when it comes to a lift in a truck, uh, you're modifying a lot of major components on that vehicle. So as far as expense um, and wear and tear on the vehicle, it, it does make sense to, to spend that money up front to reassure that you're not going to have any major issues with that vehicle down the road, especially when, when you're talking about structural changes to the vehicle. Um, BDS does stand by their product, product as well. On all their boxes, they actually have marked uh, no fine print warranty, basically meaning that uh, any of their product that they have installed on the trucks, they will cover and they do have warranty on and uh, there, there is a lot of uh, coverages through Chrysler as well in the truck. Um, some of the, the basic wear and tear things, of course, will not be covered. This is a one-ton truck, so you're definitely gonna feel that, uh, that one-ton ride. But we've tried to, we try to make it as comfortable as possible. Um, obviously, with, with the stabilizer kit, with the Fox shocks, we're trying to help out with that. You're still going to get a bumpy truck, but a lot of people do expect that who are in the market for these sort of trucks. Um, and they, and they kind of make the sacrifices for you know what the truck's capabilities are. And it's also a really great looking truck. Appeal is a huge thing. We park these things by the road, and uh, we, we can literally have a Dodge Viper out there. In northern Alberta, they're, they're going to drive by it. Uh, if you have a lifted uh, 3500 diesel truck out front, everybody's going to be coming in, they're going to be licking the paint and they're going to be fogging up the windows. Yeah, we're, we're trying to make a, a very specific brand for the market uh, for lifted trucks, which is huge in Alberta, um, to meet those needs. And, and a lot of people, you know, they don't know what they want. They, they want a lifted truck. They don't know what it takes to, to get a proper build together. And, uh, you know, a lot, a lot of people in the area are, are just kind of going off of uh, what a customer kind of thinks that they need or want on the truck when they come in. But we, when we kind of go through an explanation on why we're building the things we do and uh, why we stay fairly consistent with our builds, um, you know, they, they normally end up going with the product that we have built on the ground instead of going with uh, another alternative. And uh, sometimes we can sway from, uh, from different lift kits, different builds that they're interested in, uh, just for the fact of uh, going for a drive in one of ours and, and hearing that explanation. We'll take them back to the shop, we'll introduce them to the, the technicians who install the lift kits, they'll go through that with them as well and just go through the process of, of what they did to the truck, how they modified it, why they believe that the product we're doing is, is far superior to everyone else's. David J. Tingley, the only place to get a rig-ready Ram is from Redwater Dodge.